The question is how to find duplicate files on Windows 11. Well, can you do it? Actually, yes, you can find them easily for free without paying a single coin. So firstly, you have to go ahead to the Microsoft website, pcmanager.microsoft.com and then download the PC Manager application from the Microsoft Store. Once you have downloaded, you have to go ahead, uh, get, click on get or click on open after the installation is done. It's going to open the application okay once it is done you have to go to the storage section and now from here you will notice there is the option of duplicate files all you have to do is just simply click on that and uh, it's going to take a while to simply scan for all of the duplicated files inside your computer and once it is done it's going to show you uh, the location uh, of where they are located and then if you are confirmed or sure that they are duplicate files, you can just simply go ahead and delete them right away. Now, please wait a moment until it should done with the scanning of the duplicated files. So as you can see, this is the report. Uh, there are the same file of adsense as you can see that's the video and it is located inside a uh, desktop and the other file is located inside the drive d so if you want to delete that permanently you can just select one of them how about uh, select the desktop version yes and now select permanently delete so as you can see it is done just like that so there are the other files that you can simply go ahead and then uh, select them and then delete them just like that also you can view them by the type of the document video or pictures or the compressed files so as you can see uh, in my case there is the audio jingle music that i using i am using for the video editing and then the other details so as you can see now the same files are located inside the uh, same folder now sometimes it's really confusing because of their names so there are really a lot of duplicated files i really need to get the hand of a okay 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 so you got the idea this is how you can just simply go ahead and use to delete duplicated files inside your windows just like that i hope that this video was helpful to you oh and by the way if you think there is another tool which is better than this let me know in the comment section i'll be happy to embrace the knowledge for now have a nice day goodbye and i'll meet you guys in the next video